And Bill Belichick has a great quote, the more you can do, the more you can do. So if you can do both, you can do both. So that's the thinking, is just to increase his versatility and yep. to... Uh, is that a sign that maybe the receivers are, uh, some of the other receivers aren't healthy? And depth. Is? Looking for depth. Mm -hmm. You talked about changes you made to practice routine. Have you made much, do you feel like, toward game preparation? Not really. Um, I, uh, I liked our game prep model, um, again, especially for the opener. And, I mean, there's tweaks here and there, but I think we're... I think we're right on. Again, it's you never know for sure until you play, but I, I like what I see. There are no changes as far as who's on the field, who's in the no. press box. You had talked about maybe seeing the depth chart at the end of the week. Is that uh, is that going to be released today or probably Monday? Speaking for Brett, okay. <laughs> we're working on it right now. There you go. What position battle? It takes you... a long time. He types one letter at a time, <laughs> so it takes a long time. What position battles are you still looking at closely? Uh, one of the guard spots on the offensive line. Um, possibly our buck linebacker spot. Uh, man, there's not many. Those are possibles. I mean, it's so. If I had to declare, if I had to give you an answer, I'd give you those two. And then if you, I was pinned to it, I'd just say they're the same starters as we already got. Who are you looking at at Buck linebacker? Manoa Pakula right now is backing up Brandon Ogletree because Brandon's been a little bit banged up. So it's really, it's really the backup spot for Brandon to articulate it better. Has Spencer Hadley won the job at uh, strong side linebacker? Mm. No, he and Alani are both still doing a nice job. So but if I had to say today, it would be Spencer. Um, so, again, if I have to declare, it's the same, but could you see both? Probably. Over the last few years, the offense in the first game, the opener has kind of struggled with points on the board. Uh, is the offense better equipped, maybe? From what I've seen in practice, yeah. They're hard to stop, so I just kind of gauge it by that. Uh, I like the way they look. Have you done anything to make sure helmets stay on better this year with the new rule change? Yeah, there's um, the top buckles are drilled in, so you can't undo the top ones. So it only leaves the two bottom ones, and we've done our own study, and the best two chin straps that are the deepest fitting are on every helmet. They only have a choice of two rather than all the multiple ones that we've been choosing from before. Did Cameron Comer uh, offer any reason why he basically stopped attending practice? Yeah, yeah, personal reasons. He and I met in advance, and so that's kind of private and personal, obviously. Hope to get it back. How has Robbie Buckner looked? In, uh, Good. Um, his first rep in one-on-one -on -one yesterday and the day before, he intercepted a pass. So he comes out and acts like he'd been here the whole time. So it's nice to have another player out there that with some experience and some maturity and at a position where we, and we run those guys a lot. So, yeah, he's done a nice job. Um, Micah Hanneman's listed in the second field corner behind Jordan Johnson, but Buckner will be in that mix too. Is Mike Hague someone you use at corn? Possibly, yeah, boundary corner. While we were waiting, are you um, just eager for the kickoff to get here? Everybody like is. We're, we're, there's still I mean, more it, you can do we, to get ready. No, we, we can still do a lot more in terms of mental preparation, but it's time to play. And players know that, I know that. And so the trick is to make sure that you structure practice in a way to really be leveraging the areas you need to work. And so, you know, it's, that's what our job is every day as coaches, to make sure the format helps us get better. Justin Thanks. kicked a little more than, yeah. uh, I, I know you don't like being asked about it, yeah. but uh, it looks like he's still on track. <laughs> that's that's where we are. <laughs> when when, he, you get when and if he kicks on game day, I expect a group hug from all of you saying, man, <laughs> we promise never ever to doubt you again. If he doesn't, I've just set myself up, haven't I? So, I understand. Thanks.